Okay, Aries, sorry about that. Spirit cut the message short and then gave me a little ad lib afterwards. So we're going to cut it there. Um, let's talk about Aries, you and the new person. Spirit's in the building. <laughs> Six of Swords. Okay. I do see a spiritual connection there. You and the new person, Aries. A spiritual connection, Aries. Yeah. There's something here on divine timing with the uh, three of so three of swords. It's like what comes around goes around with the wheel card. Um, tables turn, baby. Tables turn. You know. The head one day and the tail in the next. It's just that's how it goes. Huh? They really want to talk about this three of swords business. Yeah, this Four of Cups, Three of Swords, King of Pentacles, Queen of Cups, Reverse. Crossing the wheel. Oh, okay, so I'm seeing some bad karma here. Um, Aries, Four of Cups. I have somebody here really feeling helpless. Um, this could be the new person that you're either dealing with now or in the future. You're going to need, you're going to run across somebody that really needs a lot of help, baby. Um, something here, they're going through a really rough patch. Something's bad is going on with them. This person is stable, but they're very closed off. Their heart is closed off. This person is really going through a rough patch. Really going through a rough patch. You know, maybe even um, experiencing some bad karma. Bad karma. It's unfortunate. This is, if not experiencing bad karma, all I'm going to say is it's unfortunate. Whoever you're going to meet or you're dealing with now, this person really needs help. There is a third party interference here, and I just don't know how many or what that severity of the interferences are, but this person's really been through the ringer. They do have money. They are stable, but love is not this person's strong suit. I think this person has been played a lot. And it's just been a series of unfor unfortunate events for this person. Um, they don't have the king of pentacles upright. This person is more masculine. They tend to focus on their successes. They're really not open to love. They're kind of, their heart space is very shut down. They kind of feel like love. They've never gotten anywhere with love. So therefore, um, they kind of stop believing in it. And it's because of all these unfortunate events this person has been through. Uh, this person's been through a lot. I mean, a lot. A lot. This person, um, they are stable. Just know that going in that this person ha is dealing with some dealing with some stuff, honey. And I do think that this person kind of has a savior complex. Like they need help. They need a savior at this point. Yeah, Knight of Wands reverse. This person, damn. They, you know, Aries, I don't know about this person. Uh, this person, they need saving, okay? I, if you want to play, like you're going to, I mean, if you want to save this person, Captain save -a seriously, go for it. All I'm saying is this person has, really needs help. There's been a lot of third-party interference, and I don't know if this person finds themselves in third-party situations a good bit where they're the ones taking an L they're the ones getting hurt they are successful they do have a little bit of money um if not it, they're not successful I have a player here straight up Aries I would warn you against this I don't like the energy if this person is experiencing some things it very well could be bad karma I would say this is going to be a no from me. Um, this person is genuine. They are hurt. They do need help. They've been involved with a lot of third-party situations. They come across as a damsel in distress. 
the more I look at it, it just seems like they need a savior, King of Pentacles. They're looking at people that can save them, that are in the position to save them financially, that look stable. Um, I've got to be honest with you, with the Queen of Cups in reverse, this is somebody that their heart is shut off, most likely due to their experiences. It is unfortunate, but this person's a player, and I felt it before. I just kind of didn't want to say it. I was trying to give this person the benefit of the doubt. I do think it's unfortunate. I do think that this person is eating some of their own karma. Knight of Wands in reverse. This person they're not capable of love right now okay and if you do entertain them they will play you i'm just letting you know i would not do this night no not knight of wands in reverse knight of wands upright comes for a good time not a long time in the reverse this is the severity of someone this is somebody who's too damn old to be a player straight up and ran through in my opinion because this is an older energy um, King of Pentacles, Queen of Cups, you too damn old. And in my opinion, ran through. Knight of Wands in reverse is the severity of being a player. Meaning this person's been around the world and I, yeah, yeah, yeah. This person's been around, baby. I get around. This person's been the fuck around, okay? They've been around the block a couple times, okay? Knight of Wands reverse is the severity of being a player. This, the, Somebody here is experiencing the consequences of being a player, meaning Knight of Wands in reverse, this person could have some type of sexual disease. I'm just keeping it on it with you. Yeah, definitely. Yep. And they're detached. No, this is a no from me. Queen of Swords. No, no, no. They're bitter. They're nasty. This person is going to play you and then they're going to cut you off and they're going to be so cold. Um, I don't know if they're after, um, it feels like an exchange with them, almost like a prostitute vibe where this person comes across as help me. I really need help. I'm so down on my luck. And here comes Captain Savaho. I'm being honest with you here. Queen of Cups in reverse is a very perverse person this is somebody who will pervert this person is going to flex their sex basically shorts too short tops too tight too short this person is perverse um this person is experiencing bad karma i don't i think they are being somewhat sincere about their dire straits situation I don't see this person has changed. In fact, it's just made them who they are. I am just, I'm giving you an explanation for why this person behaves the way they do. Do I think that this person's been hurt? Yes. But the fucked up thing with this person is this person's now hurting people. You know, some people don't want to do that to others. Like, I don't want to put anybody through that kind of pain. This person has been hurt. Therefore, they are now a karmic with the wheel reverse this is bad karma but i'm gonna let you know you deal with this person they're gonna put you through hell knight of wands reverse this is a player very cold very cutthroat matter of fact uh queen of swords is a divorcee and this is in the future this is somebody here that's gonna play with you play with your money play with your heart cut you off divorce i mean i'm serious i would not i know that it looks like you just got out of a really bad situation with whatever that was um i don't know what it is about you i do see that you're somewhat successful aries um you appear stable you get a lot of attention you get a lot of attention baby People have learned of your, your success. They've learned that you not only obtained it, you've, you've sustained it. You got a lot of people flirting with you. You need to be aware, and I do think I'm talking to a dude, but if not, and you're not a man, I'm just letting you know, there's women out here like this, and I'm being told with the Queen of Cups in reverse because they very easily could have just gave me the Knight of Cups reverse, and it's the same damn card. I think this is a woman. I think I'm talking to a dude. Listen, sweetie pie. You need to be careful because you are just, it feels like you've um, leveled up and the women are getting prettier and they're getting more cunning. 
and these women out here, these are professional paid prostitutes. In my opinion, that's what you're dealing with. I am so sorry. I know everybody wants to think the next person they go come across is going to do them better. Baby, I, this person here, I don't know if it's your sexy exy that's obsessed with you. Either way, be the way. Whether it's this, whether it's the ex or a new person, not right now, baby. No, no. Check back with me in a couple weeks, but right now, today, the answer is not just no, but hell to the no. To the no, no. Hell no. <laughs> hell no. Hell, 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 hell no. This person's going to run you fucking dry. Mm -hmm. It's unfortunate. This person's just not capable of love. They're not. They're not. Um, they were hurt, therefore they're hurting others, okay? Is there any other messages that you want the Aries person to know? Hell no. To the no, no, hell no. You did have the spirit guide card with the lovers. That is a divine union. Um, I do think one is uh, coming up for you, but I, it's not right now. It's on down the line. You know, six of swords means it's on down, on down the well. It's, it's, it's. You still got a little ways. You got a couple more miles to go, baby. <laughs> a couple more miles, okay? Just slow your roll. Put it in cruise control for a minute, okay? We ain't that big of a hurry. All right, um, messy. That's all I can do. Your last, both of y'all really ain't got nothing nice to say. Okay, okay, Aries, that's what I'm talking about. Aries, last minute messages for you. I do see in the future, once you get past this little hump, your lovely lady lumps, lady person that you're about to deal with, this is for a dude. I do see you taking interest or someone taking interest in you. And I think that you two will have things in common. And I do think that you two enjoy outside things. This is somebody that you're gonna click with immediately and they're gonna match you step for step. This is part of your new cycle with the Empress, hail to the year. This is the type of divine partnership you're looking for. It is a new soulmate coming in. You do have a new soulmate coming in. Um, for some of you, be careful because Ace of Wands is a real steamy connection and that's right up your alley. You are the Wands family. Ace of Wands, I see something real attractive here and it's gonna launch this new cycle and the Empress is a mother. I mean, that is a very fertile mother and I do see a connection here and a possible baby, you know? I see it moving quickly is all I'm gonna say. I don't know if you're out here trying to make a baby. If that is the case, don't worry. You ain't gonna have no problem knocking somebody up. But what I am gonna say about it, I like this person, Empress of you. This is, this is one of them relationships that's going to stand it's going to stand on its own for a while uh definitely it's coming up but it i'm giving you a silver lining keep in mind this person will like to do outside things they're going to have common interests with you they're also going to know how to pull their own weight the empress card is a giver she's a nurturer she loves, she loves hard. Everything she touches flourishes. You can tell when she's been to your house. It's cleaner. It's straightened up. She's put groceries in the grocery. She's put groceries in the refrigerator. She's done her laundry. I mean, I'm not trying to paint, you know. All I'm saying is the person who loves you the way you love them, you're going to know it because they're going to sacrifice time, money, and energy and resources for you. It's not going to be a one-way street. And that's what I'm seeing that you have been dealing with for a while. You're going to know genuine love when someone is willing to go 50-50 with you and put in the same amount of effort. Okay? Um, I do see that this is a really stable, committed relationship. Most likely, I mean, if you're interested in getting married, this is the one. This is a wife. All right? So, I hope that makes you feel better. I wasn't just trying to leave you with shit there, but there is somebody coming up for you, and I, they want to talk about it again. This person here is nasty. It, this is, okay, look. With the Knight of Swords, this is a challenge that you're going to have to overcome. You're not out of the woodwork yet, is what I'm trying to say, my friend. You're not. You're not out of the woods yet with this person, okay? You have something coming up here that you're gonna have to kind of barrel through 
it is the dark, dark woods. I, you're going to have to just set the course and barrel through this one. You have some obstacles yet to overcome. Um, you have people around you that are extremely competitive. Um, these people are nasty. Nasty. I mean, these are violent people. Violent. Who are these violent people around you? I see, look, if the shit pops off like this, where you feel like you got to compete for somebody, there's too many competitors on somebody's jack. The conflicts escalate very quickly. It's always you uh, competing over, you know, there's two men or three girls or whoever. There's too many people com competing over the same energy. You are to haul ass up out of there. Let... Let the roaches be with the roaches. That's I don't know how you don't. It's not your job to stomp them all. Okay, this is crabs in a barrel. It's the severity of this is a very low vibing energy, and I just see you not about that life. However, it is going to press your buttons. It's going to trigger you to uh, want to choke slam a bee or body slam a dude. Like it's gonna, it's going to trigger you to bring out a very violent aspect of yourself this is a challenge that you do need to overcome so um you've got to get through this to get get to the other side i don't know what else to tell you about that they really want you to maintain your focus and plow through this bullshit because you got some people here i don't know how many of them it is but five of wands it's a good many that are surrounding you and they're high, they're competing with one another there's com people competing for them, and they're competing for you. It's so nasty and toxic. These are people here that do not have hobbies. They they just they start trouble. This is trouble. Troublemaking. And I just see you trying to get out of there. You're trying to, or that's the advice. Haul ass. Haul ass when you see it. Haul ass up out of there. All right, Aries, that's it, man. I hope I helped you. Yeah, don't get hoodwinked again. Don't get hoodwinked into this shit. Don't get hoodwinked into somebody else's beef. All that Captain save -a with you rushing into somebody else's beef, stay out of God's business. Somebody else, somebody here is getting some bad karma. Your challenge is going to be staying out of it. If you do get involved, you got nobody to blame but yourself because two of swords, reverse, it's going to be an extremely bad decision on your part. You are kind of being hoodwinked into, into participating into someone else's conflicts. Or this is a very manipulative energy to make you uh, compete over them. There's some type of manipulation tactic here that somebody's using and it's in a very competitive way. Where unbeknownst to you, you've done fault for this person and did not mean to and now you're kind of being, you're kind of, you've kind of been duped into being in, being with this person. You get what I'm saying? And, and you don't even understand how you got here. Like, how did I even get here? This is like a one night stand gone horribly wrong. Knight of Wands reverse. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Don't get, don't get hoodwinked into this shit now. Don't you dare. You got a lot of options out here and I see a lot of people out here fighting over them. Okay. Don't do it. Don't do it, pimpin'. Especially when you get out here and you get in these clubs, three of cups. You need to practice restraint in these bars. I see, like, you like to hang out and party. Three of cups. This is like celebrating. Celebrate. Yeah. Strength in a challenge position. This is where you need to have restraint. You get out in these clubs and your strength is really tested when you get around alcohol or you get in a setting where it's a party and there's a bunch of people around and you start seeing these girls and I don't know if it's the beer goggles or what but you really need to exercise your discernment that's all I got to say about that okay man <laughs> I hope that helps you take it